Hi, I'm here today with Alexandra Bhattacharya from uh, representing the Third World Network at the World Intellectual Property Organization Standing Committee on Copyright, uh, the, the, the 28th meeting. It's July 3rd. Can you tell me what's been going on this week? Yeah, sure. Well, there are two important issues on the table this week. Um, the protection for broadcasting organizations and also uh, work on exceptions and limitations for libraries and archives and uh, other educational institutions and, people's, and people with other disabilities. So these are very two uh, different issues, but uh, there's normative work going on in both these areas. So for the broadcasting organization, there's work towards a treaty which will give additional rights to the broadcasting organizations and update the Rome Convention. Um, and uh, similarly, in exceptions and limitations, it's, uh, it's more contentious um, where some countries, particularly the African group and Gulag, are hoping for a treaty, a binding treaty in the area of exceptions and limitations. So two very different issues, but uh, both witnessing quite uh, divergent views. How would, you, how would you describe the position of the European Union on the issues of on the one hand, the broadcasters, the people that own television stations, mm -hmm. and on the other hand, uh, libraries as, as institutions. Right, the very uh, different view. So on one hand, for broadcasting, they're very eager to have a binding treaty in this area, but in the area of exceptions and limitations, all they really want to do is uh, discuss principles and objectives and share experiences, and their their current, um, well, their current position is that Currently, the copyright exception limitations in national legislation are sufficient, and there is no need for a binding, a binding issue. However, on the broadcasting treaty, they're obviously not following their same uh, principle, and whereas they're saying that national legislation, national framework is not sufficient. So, uh, completely different views on two very well, on two different issues. Yeah. To the point of a, of a UN agency. Mm -hmm. What, what do you think is, is more important at this point in time, uh, promoting, uh, uh, sort of addressing the, the issue of, of the profitability of television stations or um, uh, creating a, an environment that, that addresses the concerns expressed by the libraries in terms of their, 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 their continued role in providing mm -hmm. access to information? Right, well, WIPO is a UN agency, and it is, uh, it, 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 it is under the UN Convention, so it should follow, it should follow sort of development-oriented principles, and of course, exceptions and limitations and the promotion of education and access to knowledge is what a binding treaty for exceptions and limitations would do. So in terms of, if you, in terms of following their priorities, this is what the emphasis should be. But again, it's all up to member states, and it's really hoping the member states understand the importance of having a binding treaty for exceptions and limitations. Thank you. Is there any, anything you'd like to add before I turn the camera off? Uh, no, that's okay. Thank you very much.